Hello guys, welcome back to our channel Rimtops TV. Noong nakaraang video natin ay napag-aralan natin kung paano tayo mag-add ng dissimilar fraction. Ngayon naman ay pag-aralan natin kung paano tayo mag-add ng mixed number. Pero bago yan, ay huwag kalimutan mag-subscribe, like, and share sa ating mga videos. At huwag rin kalimutan pindutin ang ating notification bell button para magiging updated tayo sa ating mga bagong upload na videos. Hello guys, sa ngayon ay pag-aralan natin ang addition of mixed numbers. So, pero bago tayo pumunta sa ating bagong pag-aaralan, uh, i-review muna natin kung paano tayo nag-add ng dissimilar fraction. So mayroon tayong given number dito, 2 over 7 plus 3 over 5. So ang ginawa natin, hinanap natin yung LCM. So ang LCM ng 7 at 5. So, gamit ang skip counting. So, ang skip counting by 7, 7, 14, 21, uh, 28, 35, and 42. So, skip counting by 5, ay 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So, mayroon tayong and 35. So, ang ating uh, LCM ay 35. So, 35 mayroon din 35 dito. Okay. 35 divided by 7 is equal to uh, 5. 5 times 2 5 times 2 equals 10. 35 divided by 5 equals 7. And then 7 times 3 equals 21. Then add natin yung numerator at i-copy natin yung common denominator. So ang 10 plus 21 equals 31 over 35. So the answer is 31 over 35. So, wala nang lowest term yan kasi wala nang common or greatest common factor na makadivide sa 31 at 35. So, ngayon ay pag-aralan natin kung paano tayo mag-add ng mixed number. Okay. So, in adding mixed number, ang una natin gagawin ay i-add natin ang dalawang whole number. So, gagawin natin ay 2 plus 7 equals 9. And then, isunod natin yung fraction. So, 1 fourth plus 1 third. Ito, ang ating fraction ay dissimilar. So, ang gagawin natin, hanapin ang less common denominator. So, ang less common denominator ng 3 at 4 ay 3, 6, 9, 12. And then, 4, 8, 12. So, ang less common denominator ay 12. Okay. 12 divided by 4 equals 3. 3 times 1 equals 3. 12 divided by 3 equals 4. 4 times 1 equals 4. Add the numerator and copy the common denominator. So, 3 plus 4 equals 7. So, the answer is 7. Oh, no. Ang answer natin ay 7 over 12. So, ang ating whole number ay 9. So, magiging 9 and 7 over 12. So, ito lang ang pag-add ng mixed number. So, ikalawa natin halimbawa ay 5 and 4 over 5. So, una, i-add natin yung 5. 5 plus 3 equals 8. And then, fraction 4, 5 plus 1 half. So, makaiba ang denominator. So, ang common denominator ng 5 at 2 ay 
10 10 Then divided by 5 equals 2 2 times 4 equals 8 10 divided by 2 equals 5 5 plus 1 equals 5 So i-add natin Magiging 8 plus 5 equals Equals 13 over 10. So, dahil ang ating sagot ay nasa improper fraction, isimplify natin, gawin nating mixed form. So, ang 13, 13 divided by 10 equals 10. 13 divided by 10 equals 1. 1 times 10 equals 10. Subtract. So, ang natira ay 3. So, ang sagot ay 1 and 3, 10. So, ang ating quotient ay magiging whole number natin. Then, ang remainder ay magiging numerator. Ang ating denominator ay ang divisor. Okay. So, the answer is 1 and 3, 10. Plus, by whole number tayo dito na 8. Magiging 9 and 3, 10. Okay. So, another example. Okay, so example number 3 3 and 1 fifth plus 2 and 1 seven. So, una, i-add natin yung whole number 3 plus 2 And then, 3 plus 2 equals 5 And then, a fraction ay 1 fifth plus 1 seven. So, una, hanapin natin yung common denominator So, multiply na lang natin 5 times 7 equals 35 So, 35 divided by 5 equals 7. 7 times 1 equals 7. 35 divided by 7 equals 5. 5 times 1 equals 5. Then add. 7 plus 5 equals 12 over 35. So, mayroon tayong whole number na 5. Magiging 5 and 12 over 35. Okay, so ganun ang kadali kung paano mag-add ng mixed number. So, mayroon tayong isang uh, gagawin na halimbawa. Okay, so ikaapat na halimbawa ay 2 and 1 eighth plus 3 and 1 third. So, una, i-add natin yung whole number. 2 plus, no, 2 plus 3 equals 5. And then, 1 eighth plus 1 third. So, ang kanyang common denominator ay, i-multiply na lang natin to, 8 times 3 equals 24. 24. Then, after that, is i-divide natin. 24 divided by 8 equals 3. 3 times 1 equals 3. 24 divided by 3 equals 8. 8 times 1 equals 8. Then, add... The numerator, 3 plus 8 equals 11 over 24. So, ang ating whole number ay 5. So, magiging 5 and 11 over 24. Okay, yun lang muna sa ngayon guys. Sa susunod ay pag-aralan naman natin kung paano tayo mag-subtract ng similar at dissimilar fraction. So, salamat at God bless po sa lahat. Oh. Mm -hmm.